back in uh, 2016. I was working in the construction industry on the management side and I noticed um, as the year went on, I was getting breathless, struggling to get around. Nevertheless, you know, on site visits, which was part of my job, um, I would have been exposed to asbestos on quite a few occasions. I thought in the end, I better go and get checked over. And um, uh, it turns out that um, I did have mesothelioma. After chemotherapy, one of the nurses at my local hospital suggested that I might uh, might do well to um, start a um, civil case. I was recommended to Hodge, Jones and Allen um, and from there I was put in touch with Isabel Lovett. Well asbestos disease cases and particularly mesothelioma claims are very technical and difficult to investigate. My job is to try and reassure my clients um, at the outset that, that they're in capable hands. I have to be able to um, obviously succeed in the claim for them, but I also have to take into account their needs as the case is going on. And so often when they first instruct me, they've just received the diagnosis and they're still in a state of shock, really. We're specialists in a particular area, and this has been my area of specialism for about 18 years now. And we have to develop a personal relationship with, our, with a client in this situation because we're talking about very personal matters and they're of huge importance to the client. So that personal touch, I think, is really critical in this type of case. The whole case went on for um, over 18 months and um, they uh, resisted every attempt that we made. Um, there were a couple of hearings and um, we tried to appeal at one point and that got rejected. Hodge, Jones and Allen just stuck to it and um, eventually the defendants did decide to meet us. The future is in the, the, the way the settlement has been agreed, which is a two-part settlement. It's um, partly compensation money and the second part is a, an indemnity has just been set up for future treatment. If I'm taken off this trial, I have no rights to go back on it. Um, but if I've got this, this indemnity that's now set up allows me to draw on it for future private treatment. To me personally, it's hugely satisfying to be able to win a case, particularly one that involves some security for the future for the injured person and for their family and we're able to achieve justice for people who've been put in the position that Andrew was through no um, fault of his own. All he did was go to work and he was exposed to a very dangerous substance at a time when his employers knew um, that this could harm him. They ought to have protected him and they didn't. I would recommend Hodge, Jones and Allen. They are clearly specialists in this field and that makes so much difference because they do know what they're talking about. They have got the experience, years of experience. They know about low exposure cases, which are the most difficult to obviously to win. Um, and they know how to win those. So yeah, I would definitely recommend them. I definitely felt that they were, yeah, fighting my corner. Thank you.